And while some decided to stay inside during Abilene's first snow day, others went out and took advantage of Mother Nature. KTX's reporter John Groby was out and about talking to people who had a little fun in the snow. Downtown Abilene kicked off to a slow start on Monday. The ducks are kind of starving today. But the icy conditions and cold weather didn't stop some from going outside. Stephen Roscoe is from upstate New York. Coming out on a nice snowy day. He braved the howling wind. Get too close, we'll scare them all away. And cold temperatures to take a walk on the wild side. Snapping some pictures of these pelicans. Winter weather is the rarest of things I get to take pictures of down here in Texas. I put so many layers on and we've been running around with the dog, so it is perfect for playing. And a group of friends decided to take a day off with man's best friend. I think the dogs are warm too. <laughs> They've been staying really active. Oh, hush. But this winter weather, not fun for everyone. The icy conditions creating a lot of hazards on the roadways. I-20 was shut down today. This 18-wheeler jackknifed on I-20 near Loop 322, blocking most of the lanes. The driver was not hurt, but the interstate was shut down while the wreck was cleared. As the sun shines and the ice melts, more and more cars are hitting the roads. In Abilene, John Groby, Hey, Texas News. Again, you heard about refreezing tonight. If you do want to find out current road conditions this evening, we put those up on our website, ktxs.com.